And we have actual evidence that um, one of the trans girls had ended up killing him. So we're just trying to do like an update to see, um, can we bring like the news people um, and actually like have an interview with the mother because she has like evidence that they were involved and they're trying to continue the case um, for the murder. Because it wasn't a suicide attempt, it was actual murder. Um, yeah, I have the contact for the mother. Um, somebody can take my contact down. I would appreciate it. I can, they can contact me and I can get you guys directed, um, directly to her. Okay, sounds good. What's your name? My first name is Gardini, G-U-A-R, D as in dog, I-N-I. -I. Um, my last name is Bellfleur, B as in boy, E-L-L-E, -L -L -E, F as in Frank, L-E-U-R. My numbers. Yes, it's going to be Maurice's mother. It's Maurice Willoughby. Um, yeah, and we're definitely proving that um, the girlfriend, Faith Palmer, she actually called um, the police and made it seem as if that it was a suicide attempt. But they actually had fleed and left to go to New York because, you know, they're actually like prostitutes. So they ended up fleeing to go and leave the body there and things of that nature. So her story was the only story that was um, put out there to the police department. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, right. um, that's why I was contacting you guys because the mother's actually going to go to the police station and things of that nature. Um, so I said I wanted you guys to actually be there because, like I said, I have a huge following on social media. And I feel like that three years ago when they ended up um, having this situation and him passing away, it was only the trans girl that had a story to tell. Um, the mother actually has been fighting constantly to get this story um, heard. Um, and we have the backing when it comes to social media to, to, to help her push to get this you know, out there. Um, she's actually going to the police. She's at tomorrow morning. She's gonna. Um, she has set an appointment with them, so she's gonna go there first thing at ten o'clock in the morning. So I wanted to reach out to make sure you guys can contact her and then. Yeah, I'm not just asking the question to get the details. Mm -hmm. And what police station? Um, I'm not sure because I'm not from Philly, so I'm really not sure to be honest with you. Okay. All right. Well, I will uh, write this up and let our reporters know for tomorrow. Okay. Which station is this again? 6 ABC. Okay, perfect. Um, as soon as you contact me, whoever contacts me, I can give them the mother's information, and then you guys can go from there. Okay, good. I, I appreciate you. Thank you. No problem. All right. Bye. No justice, no peace. Them trannies going to jail for Maurice. No justice, no peace. Them trannies going to jail for Maurice. No justice, no peace. Them trainees going to jail for Maurice. Yeah. And you hoes ain't getting get another motherfucking client, bitch. Because we flagging your ass. And Trey definitely coming to your house. Go ahead and send me that address. Go ahead and send me that address, please. If you in Philly. And you hoes don't mind getting silly. Yeah, send me that address. Thank you. Lady Ray can't help you. I don't matter what the fuck she try to get you hoes. It ain't going nowhere. Because, bitch, I'm Donna. I do bitches for a living, Donna. Huh. Oh, okay. Bitch, it's talking about everybody that life. But when Trey was shooting at you and Kamoy, bitch, your motherfucking faggot ass was the same one jumping out the motherfucking window, leaving your girl. You forgot that? But you about that life. Girl, get out of here, little, little, little nigga. Little Puerto Rican boy in drag. Get your ass up out of here. Sick of the face shit. I'm so sick and tired of being sick and tired of being sick and tired. Sick and tired. We know the story. Little Puerto Rican boy in drag. Stop playing. When Trey was shooting at you hoes, guess what you hoes did? Jumped out the window. Fuck out of here, bitch. And you got your big ass gremlin tranny of a motherfucking girl. Talking about you taking up for your bestie. Bitch, tell your bestie she had all them teeth on KD and everybody else. She should have came out and said it. I don't believe shit a bitch said. I want to see it from Wildcat. Open your mouth. Move your nose from the left side. Bring it to the right side. Fix your lip. Bitch, and speak. 
That's what I want you to do. You come out and speak. Not your trainer who's soft as fuck. With that big ass dick, with that one vein, bitch. Prostitute and sucking dick, getting fucked wrong on these fans. Bitch, cause she can't got nothing else going on for her life. I don't want to hear from her. Go and Trey pull out that Glock on her, she runs. When Trey pull out that Glock on her, she runs. She jumps out the window. Woo! She fo fo. She can fit through a window. Fuck out of here, bitch. No justice, no peace. We take them trains to jail for Marie. Yeah, we ain't stopping. I know I'm not. It don't matter what you hoes say. It don't matter what you hoes say. The point of the matter is, you hoes are shook. Cause we bringing back our reality. And this time, we're gonna get justice for Marie. That's all. That's period. Period. Hello. Period, Donna. We getting justice for Maurice, baby. Sure is. And I and I ain't stopping. Thank you, bitch. I ain't stopping. I ain't stopping, bitch. Merch coming out. No justice, no peace. We sending them training to jail for Maurice. No justice, no peace. We sending them trainees to jail for Maurice. You going to jail in my sister Perez voice. Thank you, big. Okay. If you guys are in here, I need everybody to call 215-686-TIPS. And let them know you want to do a tip about a murder. About fake motherfucking Palmer and her trainee ass sister. Kevin Capone. Kevin Capone. You, you said he was an addict. The addict was, them hoes was feed, feeding him all type of drugs and fentanyl. That was the addict. That was the addict. That's the addict. You can't tell me a fuck thing. You can't tell me a fuck thing when the sh the words that your nigga wrote, the words that your nigga wrote, was y'all can say whatever about faith. I really don't care if she's not passable. I don't care if she was the born a woman. She's a woman to me and I love her flaws. That's what makes her faith. If you heard her story, it's motivating. What story? That you was raped? That you was molested? Bitch, what story? We don't give a fuck about that hoe. Being raped or molested don't make you come out to be an ugly ass creature with a fucked up nose, a fucked up lip, bitch seven feet, bitch wearing leggings and a big ass 11 inch cock. That don't make you fave. That's not fave. Okay? You're not fave. You don't give a look of a fave. You don't give a character of a fave. You don't smell like a fave. You're not fave. Your name should be Hell Palmer. Hell Palmer. See, the thing with me, I, I, I focus on the target. See, you got Kim Capone doing your dirty work for you. I don't give a fuck about that chihuahua. I ain't worried about no Mexican motherfucking bitch who want to be a nigga with a huge ass motherfucking silicone sitting in her cheeks that when it turns cold outside, her cheeks get stiff like she a statue. She ain't my problem. No big dick ass trainee with no one big ass vein that's throbbing through her shit. Every time bitch she got a pee, bitch it's going tram 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 tram. She not my problem, okay? I'm not arguing no bitches that go to the gas station, bitch, to buy flip flops and tights and leggings. That's their wardrobe, okay? You 99 cent trainees need to go sit somewhere. Go sit somewhere, cause we don't take none of you trainees serious from Philly. Let's talk about it. Has anything good came out of Philly? That's a tranny. I'm just being fair. Hello? I'm just being fair. Oh, okay. Huh. I don't know them people. I don't know them people. The names y'all name and I don't know them. I don't know them. I don't know them. I don't know them. Out of here. I don't know them. 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 Sorry. Don't know them. 
Don't know them. Mm-mm. Don't know them. Don't know them. Y'all putting names out. I don't know them. Sorry, I don't know them. I don't know them. I don't, I don't know them, trolls. That's, did you hear what I said? Let's talk about it. And if y'all saying all these names that he told that came out of Philly, why? Kim Capone and Wildcat don't look like them. Why is Wildcat walking around with seven feet, bitch, with tennis shoes, walking during the daytime with no body work, botched up lips, can't afford a facial film, and then you got this blowfish, this faux feet ass motherfucking flounder, walk around with bowling balls in her motherfucking titties and bowling balls in her motherfucking cheeks. That's what you hoes relating to? Oh, I'm out of here. They sisters need to go back and do some work for them. Go back and help your sister. Go look to the left, look to the right, and say, neighbor, go ahead and grab your sister and give her a helping hand. Fuck out of here. Give your sister a helping hand. Where he at? I hope y'all better have kicked him out of here. Y'all better. Oh, okay, yeah, she, she kicked. Yeah, she better have got the fuck up out of here. Fuck out of here. Right, Kayla. No justice, no peace. Lock them trainees up for Maurice. Peace. Um, so yes, you guys, 215-686-TIPS. We're going to put all the tips in. We're waiting for the news channel to definitely hit us back up. So we can get the mom on the call. The mama will be going to the motherfucking um, jailhouse. I'm not the jailhouse, but the police station tomorrow to make sure the case is reopened up. And we're going to use our social media platform to lock these trainees up. No justice, no peace. Lock them trainees up for my reason. Oh, okay. Yeah, we got, got you whole shook. We got you whole shook. And it's not the first time. Because now we're going to bring up... We're going to show the video from YouTube to the police. How y'all was getting sucking dick and getting shot up at. And bitches had to jump out the motherfucking window because you got a prostitution human trafficking household. You got a prostitution human trafficking household with drugs, weed, fentanyl, and all type of shit in there. I mean, ain't that how you said Maurice died? An overdose? Because you hold be getting high off your own motherfucking supply. Yeah, them perk 50s. Why you playing? Reaching the game. Losing hands. The Molly. That's all underneath Wildcat's motherfucking bed. Oh, yeah, girl. It's going down, Donna. <laughs> it's going down. It's you hoes that's killing them niggas out of Philly, bitch. Got a green reef for some motherfucking Christmas. Yeah, girl. Perk 50. Ooh. Oh, Perk 50. Ooh. What's up? Rosa, I know, I know you defending. I know you do. I know you. Hold on, let me step out the room. You said what? I know, I know you defending the boy. You trying to get justice for the boy. But what about what about when the tra be killing the trans girls? Like they don't go hard for justice for us. And Did a lot of girls, a lot of girls, a lot of girls, I'm trans, and a lot of girls don't be like, don't be playing like um, cunt. A lot of girls just be, a lot of boys just be insecure with themselves, and they just be killing the girls. What about that? A lot of girls be tricking the boys too. But that's not a lot of. I don't, I, we're not talking about the ones who don't. No, my we're talking about the ones that no, do. No, my home, Listen, Rosa. My homegirl was killed because a boy was trying to talk to her. And he knew her teeth and he killed her because he his friends was there. Like no shade. So a lot of girls don't be getting killed because they don't tell their teeth. A lot of boys just be insecure and they don't want their people to find out and they end up killing the girls. But I understand what you're saying though. Justice for Maurice. No shade. Take away from that. Let's not take away from that. It was two trainees, bitch. That got a boy drugged up. Motherfucking killed him and left him to go prostitute in New York. Let's not take that. That's like y'all saying black lives matter. And the white people say, well, what about the white lives? We're not talking about the white lives right now. We're focused on black lives matter. Okay. That be our problem. Y'all be so invested. We want to give y'all stories. Baby, we talking about justice for Maurice. No justice. No peace. Lock them trainees up for Maurice. That's what we talking about. Uh, since you played my message, I'm asking up here. We talk about the Reese that sit out here with the accent and the pretty eyes? No, the boy name, no. Oh, okay. Let me show my fat ass. No, that's my Reese name. Yeah, that's people who saying Reese is people that's from Philly. That's what they know him by. 
I need that address. Find me that address. Find me that address because I want to make sure I send the police over there. Find me that address. I need that address. So I don't know what ad y'all need to call. In fact, how about y'all do this? Since they was giving KD number out. Since they was giving KD number out. What's that ad? Somebody send me that ad. No, you don't know, Renee. Okay. I like bitches know I'm coming. I don't like... I want a bitch know I'm coming. What's up? I just want to tell these people to stop deflecting, Rosa. Tell them to stop deflecting. It's not about what she was just talking about. It's about what they did to that boy. And that shit is all over the fucking news. And it happened in 2019. I just looked it up, literally. And I was like, what the fuck? And it's a picture of her kissing him on her fore on his forehead. Like, she really loved him. Baby, you talking about, you talking about, you live your life and your truth. You, 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 this is what your boyfriend said. I want y'all to, let me, let me flip it. This is what your boyfriend said. Somebody come up here and read it. This is what your boyfriend said. Somebody get their ass up here. Because I want y'all to read it. Not you, Sally, because they're going to they gonna prosecute you. What did it say? In the Facebook? Put it down, son. At the bottom. Oh, y'all can say whatever about Faith. I really don't care if she not... Passable. She not passable. That means he knew he was fucking a nigga. That means mm. he knew he was fucking a motherfucking seven feet giant bitch who look like a willow beast bitch who got fucked up Ooh. mouth, fucked up teeth, and everything else. He knew you wasn't passable, bitch. And he mm. still stood by your ugly criminal ass. Hey, let me see. She, she went past the ball. I don't care if she wasn't born a woman. She is a woman to me, and I love her. But also, that's what makes her faith. If you heard her story, it's motivating. I'm happy. Yeah, we don't want to hear the story that you got molested and you got raped. And, girl, why having clients? Girl, they ended up cha-cha sliding you, bitch. And they motherfucking drug you. We don't want to hear them stories. We don't give a fuck about your story. All we know is that, bitch, they gave you a name, bitch, that does not identify as you. You're not fake. You're a gremlin. You're a hit. You're a hell. You're trash. You're cum guzzler. You're a prostitute. Prostitute Palmer. Okay? Slums Palmer. Trash Palmer. That's what the fuck you is. Fuck out of here. Bitch. But again, like I said, no justice, no peace. Girl, we locking them trainees up for my reads. I'm done. My girls want me to be done. I'm done. That was it. I just wanted to shake y'all up. You know, y'all thought y'all can go live because, you know, y'all be want views. And y'all definitely are now finally finna hit. I want to help y'all. I just want to help y'all. I just want to help y'all, girl. Y'all want to hit a quota. Y'all want a storyline. Let me help y'all. Just got here. Keep going, sissy. I'm good. What's up, crook? Where my, where my remote at? Where my remote at? Where my remote at? Ooh. Anybody in Philly? Where my remote at? Anybody in Philly? Who wants to get silly? Any clients out there looking for a prostitute that wants a good time? DM Rosa. Any clients in Philly that's looking for a prostitute? DM Rosa. Yeah. I'm looking for every nigga that's in Philly that wants a nice, pro a nice seven feet prostitute with 11 inch or a four inch prostitute with a nine inch with a large motherfucking bitch vein down there, Donna, and a cheek as big as motherfucking Shauna Brooks. The power of the lash. Do you want? I any niggas that want dirty trannies with cha-cha slides from the motherfucking corner store and 99 cent leggings walking around all day, bitch, and waiting for the next $40 day. Any niggas out there, if you want a tranny and you're in Philly, DM me. I can get you there. I can get you there. Yes. DM me first, please. Donations up front.